Hello and welcome back to Factorium. This episode we're gonna start working on military science. It's um something we really really need to um to get going. Maybe here ish. So first of all, I need to double check what the hell do we even need? We need piercing round magazines, grenades, and walls. So we need this, we need walls, and we need grenades. Grenades is iron and coal. That's easy peasy. This is just stone bricks. This is ammo, copper, and steel. And then obviously we are going to need this makes two but takes 10 seconds we're gonna need five of these right this will eat one wall every second ish so one of these is enough that ratio is done. We're gonna need eight of these. Two, three, four. Is that really the case? Eight of these. We need one per second. I guess, I kind of want to double check this. I remove this. Let's add a recipe. Um, let's see. Science. This boy. Oh, whoops. And I need to close my balcony door two seconds. It's been quiet the whole day. And now suddenly they're starting some machines right outside my window. Feels great. So product output. I kind of want 60 of this. No. I need, I want one. This is, this is what I want. And I'm gonna use these assembling machines. And I'm gonna use these ones. Grenades were the one we were wondering about. That was really eight. And it turns out it is eight. Yep. So eight it is. We were not being silly. This is what we need. That's a lot of grenades. I don't have enough assembling machines. In fact, I don't have enough iron to make more. It's fine. So eight of those, and then we needed, let's see here, I think this makes, we need three of these. Okay, so one wall, three of these, and wall is gonna be the one that's on its own belt, I think. So the question here is, how do we do this without this looking like shit. Mm. First of all, let's move that down there. Boop. 
This needs two inputs. I'm pretty sure we're gonna need to have two belts with this. Now. We put that there. This is gonna need uh, one firearm magazine per three seconds. How much does this make? Okay, so one of these can feed three. That's actually really, really nice. That means we can cheat a little bit because we're running with um, big boy, big boy mods here. Trying to make this decently compact, right? Because I don't really want to um, to do some too weird stuff. This is also gonna need steel, some steel and some copper. Um, a decent amount of copper, but it's only five per three seconds. It's fifteen per three seconds. It's five per second. That actually requires its own belt. That's fine. This also needs iron. This needs iron. This needs bricks. So walls. There we go. I'm thinking it's not going well when I think. I mean, the most uh, the easiest way to do this would to be to just put them down here. We have an output of this here, right? Then we'll have an output of belts here. And we have everything we need. Maybe we can even put this here. There we go. Pretty sure we can do this. It should work fine. So these are going to need two inserters. One of those are going to be long. That's not going to need that, but these are. We have a slight shortage of inserters, I think. And I need everything. Take those circuits, because I need them. I really do need them. Okay. So these will just very nicely output here. I think we'll do this. Okay. 
I think I need a yellow belt there. Because I want to to do this, right? Pick up there. Yellow belt goes there. And then we'll have these. You will pick up from there. You will pick up from there. And drop far. This needs an iron input. There. This also needs a copper input, right? This is slightly AIDS. Just slightly. Yeah, that's copper. This is steel. This needs to be bricks. Perfect. Let's power this up. If we even can. Should be fine with these new power poles. Okay. Perfect. And these obviously go out on a belt like so and you are going to head back oh i need a lot more iron right now a lot Let's go back to the iron stuff. Our science production is not keeping up at all. What is the problem there? We're just able to consume more. Like these are running full speed. It's just that we need to kind of, we need to upgrade the assembling machines on those. We should probably do that soon. This is bricks. Let's get those in there first. I need a splitter. Then we need iron. That should probably be there. And we need coal. Where did we have coal? I think coal is here. We actually need some underground too. Oh, I ran out of wood, but I do have it. So coal comes in here jumps over these and down we go perfect there we go coal goes in there that is grenades done this needed to be steel 
Actually, let's make that copper because it's closer. Let's make that copper. Bum, bum, bum. Over these we jump. And then we jump there too. And make this copper. Oh, we need more belts. So iron needs to come over here. We need more underground belts. Mm. And coffee. Come on. Oh. This needed to be iron. Like so. This needs to jump over there. This also needs to be steel. That we did not pull out the whole way. Bum, bum, bum. Let's go. Are we excited? Probably not super excited. That goes in there. Steel should be coming in there. That goes there. Now we can take this. Now we can take this and get it all the way back. I'm at least half certain that this is going to work very well. Except this part down here, right? That probably needs to go in there too. You are lacking steel. Steel is coming down. And I need to wait for this. But most of this stuff... ...should be working. Not sure if we need this last inserter. We need something here to make sure that this goes a little bit faster. Yeah. Okay, that's a little bit better. Cool. So now we have military science. It's working. Everything is almost done. Not really, but almost. Now we can at least transport it back to our science labs. It's gonna be so good. I don't know where they are. They should be south of our current position right about now. We'll just take it in here. Like so. And then this needs to be extended. Let's just do that. Uh, we need another mini loader. We need a lot more iron. So radar efficiency went up. That's good. I really would like this too. Can we start working on some of these? I'm not even sure that we do have any of them. Or we have enough of any research at this point did stack up a little bit. Let's make one of those nice mini loaders.
Let's get it done. Okay. Perfect. That is really good. Now the next thing we probably want to do is start upgrading those assembling machines. For all the science, including military probably. Just because we want to make sure that we do have some crafting speed. This seems to be working very well. Good job. Okay. I'm not sure that our iron is going to be able to cope with us upgrading these assembling machines. But uh, our science will definitely feel better from this. Is this running full time now? Yeah, well, we're also taking a lot of it. I guess. So that's the first ones done. I love it. Um, what do we need with military science? Well, sniper turrets are gonna be the saving grace of our base, probably. How's power looking? Power is looking like shit. Not gonna lie. We are also taking a lot of coal right now. This is barely enough anymore. I'm getting slightly worried. Just slightly. We don't really have any... Well, 11 assembling machines is not going to be enough for military science. That's for sure. So we're going to go back there and we're going to take the iron again. We're going to make 13 more. Actually, we should probably just wait a little bit here. I do not want to make these circuits by hand. I just want to grab them. I can make 20 of these. That's fine. It's not like we are not gonna use a lot of assembling machines. That's Pretty much a given. Now we need two more boilers and a few more um, steam engines. We're probably also looking at um, making the coal mining just slightly more effective, I think. So four of that. We don't really have any iron pipe, unfortunately, and I think I need it down here. So coal mining needs to uh, needs to improve. I'm I'm honestly not sure if this is gonna be enough. Uh, we need uh, two of these. Um, how about this is not even... This is not even close to being enough. Okay. That kind of sucks. Not gonna lie.
Okay, we're gonna make it a little bit easier for ourselves. I'm going to make another row. A whole row. Don't know exactly how many steam engines I need for that. I think it's 20. Yeah. 10 boilers and 20 steam engines. 10 boilers, 20 steam engines. Almost five steam engines. So that's 15. Just need five more. It's almost no iron, right? So that's five more. And then we need 10 of these. This is gonna pollute like crazy, isn't it? So sniper turrets are done. Okay, we're gonna let science rest for just a moment while we try and take care of power. Everything is running pretty well now that we're not just crazily uh, spending so much power. Let's see, this is the part I want. There. That should be enough. Now we just wait for some stuff to finish crafting. I'm guessing that we'll need some more of the pipes. One of the offshore pumps, definitely needed. Potentially we're, um, we're soon there. This should be 40 megawatts ish. It, it should be 36, I think. Where, where is the offshore pump? Probably there. I mean, let's just do that. What's our max? Is this the max that our factory can draw? Or what, where is 26 megawatts? Okay, there we go, 36, that's much better. That makes much more sense. Like that's the maximum that we can produce with the steam engines that we're running right now. Obviously, I think we're just consuming every single piece of coal that we have right now. And I'd be surprised, yeah, there's nothing going to smelting, obviously. That kind of sucks. I'll be making this here. Which we cannot make with this. I wanted to make one of these fancy ass um, balancers so I can have a few more inputs, and maybe get two fully saturated belts out of that. It looks like that's gonna be difficult and all the smelting is now pretty much not doing anything. Big 
because this is not mm. not loving this right now we've been neglecting power for too long okay so there we go that goes there This goes there. Something like that. I would like to move this down one and have them a little bit f tighter saturation here. Something like that. We need more of these. A lot more of these. <sighs> and pollution is obviously going to slow down a lot now. Right. I should definitely start working on those walls. Not sure if, if this is gonna fill up or not, but it might. Can I have Wood is the problem, really. I mean, we're pretty close to the... Um, we're pretty close to the... Um, the greenhouses here. Which seem full at the moment. I don't even think that we have enough belt to run this all the way. Or maybe we do. Okay. So how do we want to do this again? Right, I probably just want to do this. I probably just want to do this, right? So this line should be fully saturated and this will just get the excess. That's what I'm thinking for now. Does that make sense? I think that makes uh, decent sense uh, anyway. Okay, so sniper turrets, they're super, super expensive uh, when it comes to iron. Not gonna lie, this here needs to be removed. I'll dump some of the stone in there. We'll take walls. And I think here is where we make sniper turrets. 
This is gears. Where is gears? Gears, plates. One, two, three. Plates, gears. Need more iron. Need another splitter. Bomb. Need a chest. That needs to be capped at probably... One. Not in there. Come on. This is not gonna take all of it, but it's gonna take a fair amount. And then we need a lot of these. And a lot of these. But iron is... I wish we had more iron. But we do not right now. Could we... What about if we have tier 2 of these machines? Small thing. No. Is it this? Metallurgy 1. Metallurgy 2. That needs clay bricks and uh, blue science. Uh, not blue science, what the fuck? Uh, my head is... My head is working worse than usual. Uh, blue circuits, I mean. That would, um, that double our crafting speed. I would increase it by 50%, so that's 450 plates per minute. That would mean that we would need to upgrade this belt. Because there's no way. Okay, there's also no way that anything is getting past this. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Um, what can we do? What can we do? What about silicon ingots? Iron smelting. Advanced iron smelting. We probably already have this. That's manganese. This is the silicon ingots. That gives a little bit more and uses silicon ore. It's not a bad idea. We're using a whole belt of this right now. I mean, nothing is going anywhere. I think I'll have to just think about what we want to do next. Not sure how much silicon we have. Or if that is wise to use, use it on right now. Where's our silicon? Our silicon is down here. We have 3k silicon. It's not like we're getting huge amounts of it. First step is probably... Trying to mine as much as possible from this and this. And then... We're probably lasting long enough for... For us to wall in. I think that's going to be the goal for next episode. We're going to build a wall that doesn't suck. 
something that can defend us a little bit early game um, would be really, really good. I'm also going to go up here. When we're capped on military science, or when military science... Um, when, whenever there's an excess w amount of walls, we need to put that into a box. I'd rather have a little bit too many walls out here defending our stuff than being like, well, we're going to build this one row here and that's going to be enough because it probably isn't. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.